What qualities do you look for in terms of what you think will produce effective collaboration, and what's your role as CEO in, in fostering that kind of collaboration? You look for, for people that uh, uh, are not political, people that are not bureau uh, bureaucrats, people that really don't care who gets credit, people that are can privately celebrate the achievement, but not care if their name is the one in the lights. Uh, you know that, that there are other there are greater reasons to do things. You look for wicked smart people. You look for people who appreciate different points of view. Uh, you look for people that care enough that they have an idea at 11 at night and they want to call and talk to you about it uh, because they're so excited about it and they want to push the idea further and that they believe that somebody can help them push the idea another step instead of them doing everything themselves. You know, I've never, I've never met anyone, in, at least in my life, maybe they exist, uh, that could do something so incredible by themselves. You know, in, in companies with global footprints and, and uh, in, in our world, in, in Apple's world, the, the reason Apple is special is that we focus on hardware, software, and services, and the magic happens where those three come together. And so it's unlikely that somebody that's focused on one of those in and of themselves can come up with magic. And so you want people collaborating in such a way that you can produce these things that can't be produced otherwise. And you want people to believe in that. 